Hello friends and welcome back to Joe Danger Plays Pathfinder Kingmaker. It's time. We're gonna head on into the Fangberry Cave and we're gonna fight some swarms. This might go really poorly, but it's kind of the last thing that we got while we wait for this fog to clear out. So let's hope that we don't uh, completely die. What is that? Anybody else see that? Like an invisible bunny. Probably wasn't very smart to run at it. As far as I know, there are killer invisible bunnies in this game. But, eh, I'm sure we'll be fine. Alright, into the cave. Give it a quick save. Let's go ahead and uh, go on stealth. Now, let's turn on a little AI on these guys. Because I want to make sure that we do not forget that we need to do our goofy goofy attacks on these. You do not have any particular... Yeah, you're just gonna heal, right? I don't think that you've got any AoEs or anything like that that we were looking at. No. You know what, if that's the case. Um, shared... Shared stash? Okay. All right, that makes more sense. That's everything, huh? Um, usable? Yeah. Let's see what AoEs we have. Snowball probably will work. I don't know about Call Lightning, Corrosive Touch... Yeah, let's just give him a couple things. Shocking Grasp... yeah. Bane? Have we already talked about the icon on there? Hmm. Cure Light Wounds, Call Lightning, Scorching Ray, that definitely sounds good. Okay, so you're all set now. Now you... You had something, didn't you? You, there we go. You're gonna be doing that. Um, we've got the AI on. Together we hey, you've got that too. It's gonna be just all kinds of acid splash, it looks like. Um, and I guess you are just gonna try to tank some damage up there, huh? We don't need a wand to f uh, find traps. I guess we'll just give you shock and grasp. I don't know. Remove blindness, I don't know. Do we have uh, any? Bombs, Vanish, Remove, Curse, Reduce, Person, Mage, Armor, Enlarge, Person, Resist, Cold, Shield of Faith. Let's give you the Shield of Faith in case things really get bad, but for the most part, I don't know what you're gonna do. Hopefully there's something. We are equipped. No, actually, everybody go forward, please. And can we talk about the formation real quick? What is this, a Stell in front? Hmm. Yeah, this is terrible. What is this? Um. Yeah, something. Jethel. You're gonna go back there. Octavia, you're gonna go back there. So we've got uh, uh, Valerie. You need to go all the way up front. Tristan. I should really just kind of be rebuilding this. That's good. That's good. You know what? This is what we want. Let's just do this like that and that. And yeah, something like this, I think. My healthiest people up front. All right, sure, call that good. What is this? Is this, nope, it is a spider. All right, let's see what happens. Repent. No, 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 uh, get back here. Fool, that looks like a swarm over there. Oh, All right, everyone. Thank you. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Jethel, what weapon do you have Stay out for now? Can you please use your bow? Thank you. You've got the bow and you've got your sword and shield. Da, 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 ba. Okay, now actually save, select everyone for real, and kill a spider. My hand. Look Time at all the fun. acid splash. Okay, mm. those are the swarms, obviously. So we definitely want to make sure that Valerie... You know what? Before you run up there, Val, just chill for a second, would you? And Regnagar? I thought you had, uh... You do, but you just didn't get the memo that I want you to attack. 
tell you what, mister. Uh, pull out your sword, please. Not that. I would like you to just go and start swinging with Valerie. Alright, both of you hold for a second. Or keep running. I'll cut you! Great. Now you guys. The Acid Splash Gang. Go for that. Tristan, I would like you to cast Bless. Okay. It's happening. Here we go. Tristan, um, we're not going to cast the heal because it could heal our evil dudes. Let's, um, it looks like Valerie is successfully tanking. Beautiful. And now, Regnagar, I would like you to switch over to the acid. Die yes. For me. Yes. Good job. All right. Tristan, you don't have any AoE. All right. Fake spider swarm. Valerie, I just need you to keep on chilling. You are doing great. Looks like we are doing damage. We got four damage. Use his ability acid splash. Miss, miss, miss. Looks like these guys are not particularly good at harming us. Oh boy. I need all of you guys to fight that. for me. Okay. There's still a swarm over there. Well, it doesn't matter. You guys can't hurt that swarm. You guys need to fight that. Jathel, move forward. Get away from there, please. Onward. Need to finish that swarm, please. What is... What, what, what happened to you? Is there... Why are you kneeling? Do we know? No, we don't. Okay, but we definitely are going to need a little bit of health coming up. Uh, that is going to be Estelle. Let's get you doing a little cure wounds on Regnagar. This whoa, 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 whoa. Should do it. Did you cast heal? I don't think you did. Will you please cast heal on Regnagar? Thank you. Next. Octavia, what are you doing? Why are you attacking that spider? I need you on this, is for this you. spider. Is there anyone else that's doing something stupid right now? You're healing. Good. You are attacking. Good. The thing that you can. You are acid splashing. Good. Correct one. Both of you are. Acid. Tavia. Acid. Good. Wait. Jathel. What are you doing? Why are you moving? Need you to acid splash, please. Okay. There's our heal. Great job on that. Thank you. Awesome work. Awesome work taking those out. And I just reiterate, please, that I need all of you guys. Does anybody not know what they're doing? Valerie doesn't. That's okay. Tristian doesn't. Tristian, excuse me. Um, what else is this? Shield of Faith. You know what? Go ahead and Shield of Faith. Regnagar, he's getting kind of rough. Spell failed. What was that? Fortitude. Check. Who knows? Alright. It's not going to tell us, so I'm not going to ask. Fair enough. Can we please? Alright, how are we looking here? We're mostly alive, which is great. Estelle, come over here, please. I'm tired of these attacks of opportunity. A calculated Next. risk. Next. Uh, uh, Jathel, I need you to do the same thing, but you're gonna go over there. There's that attack of opportunity we knew was coming. Thank you. And it looks like that swarm is smaller, so that's good. Just Pickable. You guys are the only ones that are doing that, which is exactly... Why are you swinging? should not be doing that. Run away, please. What is this ailment? I don't like it. Tristan. Need you to start healing, please. Oops. Here's, heal some moderate wounds on Mr. Regnagar. Great. Are we down to one? 
did Bregnagar actually hit with his longsword? I thought we couldn't hit the uh, swarms like that. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Valerie, just it keeps swinging. It's, it's okay. I know that you guys can't actually try to make this do much there. You guys know what you're doing, right? Yep, yep, and yep, and yep. Great. Here we go, guys. Come on. Let's bring it down. We are doing really well. I'm gonna save. Well, you don't have any more cures, so I guess I'm not saving anything. If somebody gets really low... Ugh. Kinda like that. Wait, did we kill it? Oh yeah, we did. Heal it up. Uh, give me another one. Hit me again. What was that? Suffered a- what the hell happened? Po oh, poison. But we were healing. Death's door. Characters at death's door and escaped a deadly blow only by sheer luck. If their hit points fall below their negative constitution modifier again. What the frick happened there? He failed a saving throw. Why would you need a saving throw when you are... Healing... Well, that's very strange. All right, we're gonna quick save on that one, though. All right, what did we uh, what did we learn today? We learned that that stuff sucks. What else do we have? We've got gold coins, silver ring, potion of mage armor. Okay, bang berries. Uh, I hope this is useful. Can we please run at normal speed? Yeah, thank you. I am helpless here. Um, okay. It looks like you just got more damage. Is that true? Okay. Um, nature. Do we need to keep rolling? Who's got... Does anybody else have a better... Uh, yeah. My goodness. Can we treat affliction? Does that work? No. No, it doesn't look like it. Can, can oh, you heal him yeah. like that, please? I guess. Man, I don't know what's going on there. Alright. Uh, let's take a quick look in our character and see who's got a good uh, nature. Plus zero. Plus six, plus one, plus three, plus five. All right, let's see if Jathel can pop in through here and figure out what this is. Lore check failed. Did... Can we keep going? Lore check failed. Hey. Your wish Fang granted. Bears. All right, so we can keep doing that on some modifiers. That's cool. Okay. Um, so we came in, we found a dead guy, and we got some fang berries. Well, great. Um, okay, we lost the trail. We'll meet him again eventually. Tusk Gutter, got it. Kill the giant boar, done. Uh, bring the head to Oleg. We've done that. Why do you still have a little... Because you think that you're... Mm -hmm. Prove your worth. Uh, I'm guessing that somebody wants fang berries, but uh, maybe we just haven't met them yet? Are we doing stuff we really don't have to yet? I guess... I guess so? I thought that, that was going to be a lot more uh, main questy, to tell you the truth. That's alright. Get on out of here. There we go. Definitely need to get our Tristian back home. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Alright. Yeah, let's, um... I don't like this. We definitely want him to get home. 
in one piece. So let's start moving on that. Hey, just, what's our timer like on... That's done. We lost the trail yet, but it's just all the normal land. Or, uh, just normal land, normal stuff. 67 days. Not much time has passed. On we go. Back to the trading post. Yes, please. Hmm. We'll do a nice, safe sleep, I guess, and see what happens. Why did I open this? Oh, I wanted to see if you're still busted. Okay, so you're still broken in here. Hopefully after a good night's rest, you won't be on death's door anymore. Not really sure how to get rid of that. Maybe the fang berries tell me what to do with them. Where did they go? Um. Well, we'll never know. Bang. There's no search, I'm sure. You would think that it would go towards the top. Notable. Small red berries resembling a raspberry. Alright. Hey, Oleg. You're up late. Anything going on over here? No. Alright. Maybe a good night rest will uh, tell us what we need to do. Well, you thought the character uh, leveling up episode was boring. I don't even know what's going on here. We don't have a quest. We can start wandering aimlessly, but I really want to get to the Stag Lord fellow. He sounds like a really fun person to kill, and I really want to get on with the uh, city building bit of it. Track the passing time. Well, first of all, that's very defeatist. Will fail in 67 days. Mm-mm. Not if I have anything to say about it. You're no longer on Death's Door. Okay, cool. So we did the right thing. Go talk to Oleg's wife? Are they husband? Yeah, they are husband and wife. Yep, Levitin. Nothing? Hmm. Okay. Anyone? Nothing. Nothing in the journal. We've got a, an exclamation point, but it does not. Does not tell us what to do there. Okay. Well, let's go wander around. Oh, wait, actually, let's uh, make sure that we're carrying enough rations before we take off. Just in case our hunter goes to heck. Um, I want to make sure that we do that, which I suppose, I don't remember, I don't think we picked anything up, per se. Sell the... Yep, merchant would pay well. Yeah, that's basically it. I don't have much. Am I ever going to use this? Mm -mm 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 -mm. I don't see me using it, but it is only one pound. We'll just hang on to it for now. What's this? Ancient coin. Oh, we want the antiquities collector. I think. Um. I, yeah. You know what? Let's let's learn a new recipe. Why not? Notable, usable, bendable, opposable. Um, you have supplies? Yeah? Rations? Uh, rations? R You're killing me. Cooking almanac. It's all stuff that I sold you. There we go. Camping supplies and rations. Quite heavy, right? Yeah, 10 pounds each. Um, we'll bring six. That's enough for a proper camp in case we ever mess up. Holy crap, those are so... Oh, wait, that's just because it's only my character. That's, uh...
What just happened? I think I fat fingered something, but did I quick load? It said saving. Did I hit a? Is there like a quick rest button that I don't know about? Do I have all those rations? Yeah, I've got the recipe I just bought. That was weird. All right, one new recipe learned. Fantastic. That was very odd. Very odd. All right, let's get out of here. Very slowly. Slowly run towards the exit. Do 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 ba do. Here we go. All right. Uh, still don't need any of that. Yep. All right. What party do I like? Yep. 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 Yeah, I think we're still going to leave uh, Octavia. Jathal, sorry, Octavia. This is Octavia. Yeah, this is going to be our party for now. See? Told you. Octavia. So, where to? I guess let's find what's in there. Probably not a whole heckin' lot, but it's alright. Let's make sure we unlock all the road. Not a total completionist, but I do want to make sure I just, you know, find all the stuff. This is antiques. Oh, this is, uh... Fruits and berries. Good. I hope I get a chance to figure out how that's used later. Up. Oh. Great. Oh, I guess I never connected that down there. It's alright. Waterlogged lowland camp. Or, no, just lowland. A gloomy, soggy lowland leading into a swamp. Travelers avoid this place. The swamp is dangerous on its own, but it also tends to attract monsters and other unpleasant creatures. Well, that sounds like something to do, doesn't it? If I can figure out how to get over there. All characters are fatigued. Yeah, let's, um... We'll rest. Thanks for the heads up. Let's make sure that we can do our... Nope, we don't have any honey. We can do seasoned wings. Which is even easier. Please update the meal. Whatever, it'll be alright. Hunting. And Amiri's guarding. Looks good. That'll do. Seasoned wings. Good. Rest it up. Yep. Womp wah. Oof. It's doing a pretty terrible roll to mess up those wings. And then we were attacked. Get ready. Good. I could use a little... A little butt kicking right now. Blood for Gorum! Yeah, exactly. Valerie, we have yet to see the undead fella. I guess, you know, we weren't using um, Jathel, so that wouldn't happen. Um, okay, first of all, no more AI for any of you guys. Oops, stop. Please stop. Good, good, good. No, no. No, and no. Alright. I think we'll be alright just, uh, doing a regular old attack. Tristian, can you please do a quick bless? How's your initiative? Will you be able to get that done before everybody runs off? Octavia, great initiative. And Tristian, not so much. Okay. So, Tristian, I want you to just run a little forward before you cast that bless, huh? You guys wake up. Okay, that'll do. That'll do. You're doing alright. You guys... You're still fatigued? Oh, boo. Alright, let's get that bless out. Sounds like we're gonna need it. Great work. 
What are we doing? We're all taking him out, right? Alright, now we'll go for this guy in the middle. Um... Estelle, we... Yeah, we're doing fine. Everybody? They go down! Alright. When they go down, we go high. Great job, everybody. Real quick grab this. Ooh, nice. Kobolds have treasure. Spear, garbage, and then I'm sure the... Yep, regular old garbage. Uh, what do we got for... Uh, oh wait, can I just click on this to go back to resting? Or will that, like, restart the rest? Oh, I like how you all go to your little spots. <laughs> all right, let's get out of here, guys. Good, no longer fatigued. What is this? Permanent strength damage, wow. We were restored by resting. We did rest, we've rested a bunch of times. Hm. Um, everyone? There's a way out, up here, right? Nah. How do we leave? Matt? No. Mm, I, know I don't think way. any of us know the way, frankly. Hopefully there's an exit somewhere in the fog of war, but... Let's try down. Is it always down? That's where the bad guys came from. I'd have some notes. Some minor notes for the developer. Nothing crazy, but, you know, come on. There we go. Cool. Let's go. Survive ten random encounters. We are 10% done with the survivor achievement, ladies and gentlemen. I know that that's what we're all playing for. Okay. We could go down to the old sycamore? We were trying to find the lowland. We don't know how to get there. Let's try this again. Um, yeah, let's not. Okay, let's. We will be victorious! Alright, what do we have? We've got... Looks like a trio. Ooh. No, there's a lot of bandits in here. I should get into the habit of actually counting bandits. One, two, three, four, five, six. So. Um. Hmm. Let's see. Valerie? Let go for that one. one. Estelle? You go there. Do not fall down. Amiri? You're going to be in charge of that one. I know that Tear splitting up isn't super ideal, but what I'm thinking is I want to get get Valerie tanking the melee, right? And then get a couple people on each of these ranged dudes. You look, yeah, you got a bow. You got a bow. And that way we can get our attacks of opportunity in. Um, and then that only leaves Tristian, which is fine. We are going to start off, as per usual, with a bless. Dumb. Amiri. Or Valerie, I mean. Valerie. I thought that we talked about this, that you were going to go. There we go. That's what we're looking for right there. Uh, Tristian. There you go. See, so now we've got these beautiful attacks of opportunities going on over there. Okay. And then basically the exact same thing just happened to us, except the way we don't want it to happen. Uh, Bandit. Did you just kill the bandit, Octavia? I'm... Alright, you guys need to kill them. And then we got Valerie. We got you. Actually, Tristian, can you... Come help over here. You forced Octavia, how did you knock this guy down? I'm really... Critical... Bandit, bandit... Bite, hit. He bit... Octavia. Alright, whatever. Tristine, get over there, please. Um, you know what? Regnugar, Regnugar's got that just fine. 
perfect. Thank you. And don't forget to rage now that I think about it. Octavia, run this way. I know there will be some uh, attacks about... Oh, you did die. I don't know why I didn't see that. But yeah, dead. I'll try to make this swift. Good hit on the brawler. All right. So we are attacking the dude that appears to be unconscious. Let's not bother. Aha. Okay, we are attacking in slow motion. Watch the deafness at which I will alt, alt tab and come back. And everything's vaguely back to normal. It's a cool feature. Now we've got two. I'm guessing they must have hit their own dudes with an AOE, which is hilarious. This is for you. All right, can you guys kill the sleeping one? Please don't miss. I will judge you guys. This takes an insanely long time. I'm glad he fell asleep. Done. Okay. Not bad. Could have been a heckin' lot better. Uh, yeah, actually, I would like you to heal some of our troubles, please. Ooh, nice heal on Octavia. Thank you. Let's check the map and see where we're allowed to leave. It's up here. Great sword. It's garbage. Is this hide armor? Nope. Garbage, garbage, garbage. What's this? Scroll of Doom. Yoink. Uh, short sword. A lot of garbage. That's garbage. That's all garbage. The bows. As per usual. The only things worth grabbing. Alright. Leave it. Will we find the entrance to the waterlogged lowland? Yes, we will. Yeah, let's, uh... Let's hop in. Ooh, there we go. We walked across the heath for a long time, yet no... <clears throat> Hang on. Some water. Ah, excuse me. Yet no sign, no sight sprang up before our eyes. By turns, we discovered a verdant lowland with some... Several nearabout springs. Nearabout springs? Man, I don't. Apparently, I can't read today, tonight. I apologize. Streaming down behind another hillside. And then, in the distance, in the center of the lowland among the bush, there stood a single dry tree, a true giant. Its magnificent outline resembled an animal's paw clawing at the sky. Oh, it was truly remarkable. The flat landscape was dotted by mysterious dark humps. They were piled about the height of a man and scattered around in abundance. We determined that we should explore the lowland, obviously, or we had more important things to attend, so we turned around and went back. <laughs> the further we trekked, the softer the land became. Step by step, heath grass gave way to moss, low-growing shrubs and ferns, and then sloshy puddles of stinky swamp water. The muddy ground sucked at our feet, and soon our party was jumping from hassock to hassock. Finally, we reached the first group of mysterious humps, and learned they were no mere hills, but dugout dwellings. We moved with great care toward the center of the lowland, and there the real swamp began. On the way toward the mysterious giant tree, we saw the foggy outline of another hut, this one much bigger, and surrounded by small clay statues. Uh, we could probably stand to make a lore check on nature. We examined the surrounding dwellings. We would not retreat, and moved ever forward toward the tall tree, determined to visit the big hut on our way there. Uh, standing one behind another, and tied together with a rope, we continued on our journey. Yes, please. Uh, we deemed it better that we stop struggling to push further. Please make this. All right. Beautiful. We walked slowly, carefully choosing our way, keeping it to drier ground as much as possible. But the further we went, the more difficult it became. And soon we were wading waist deep through the cattails. Frogs croaked loudly as we peered anxiously into the cloudy water, struggling to make out what shadows flitted along the bottom. We often stumbled and lost our balance, but our trusty rope, which I actually had. I wonder if that works with a rope. Um... And the aid of our friends saved us from being lost to the bog. 18 experience. 
The insatiable bog gurgled hungrily after us, but we didn't look back. Sodden and weary, we finally made it back to solid ground, and a palace of sorts rose before our eyes, a spacious hut made of mud like the rest, but decorated with pebbles, bones, cattail spikes, and snail shells. In front of the palace was a wide and shallow reservoir. Its green water reflected the leaves of the huge ferns and primitive clay figurines. The buzzing of gnats was nearly deafening. We were not far to the center of the swamp, and a firm and steady path led there through the thick bushes. At its end, that tall, dry tree stretched mightily upwards, clawing at the firmament. Uh, carefully examine the clay figures, trying to fathom what they might portray. For sure, we're going to try the world check. We've got a lot of... Yeah, DC 7, you got plus 10. Over 50-50 chance. Let's go. What's up now? Uh, goggle eyes, flat heads with no necks, ears or chins, ugly, ugly long legs, unnatural bent. These sculptures could only be the work of boggards. I wonder why they call them boggards. Hmm. Uh, primitive, cruel boggard tribes had inhabited the swamps of the Garand and Aviston since the olden days, pitiless to the others and to each other. They were led by the darker instincts of their insane priest kings. They are known to grow young fry and pools inside their houses. Grow young fry? They are known to grow young fry. In the pools inside the house. Okay. I don't know what fry are. It, it, it looks like, uh, like a little gang of Care Bears. Except they sound a little meaner. The buzzing of gnats was nearly deafening. We were not far. Yep, yep. Okay. So we move forward, seeing we'd drawn so near our goal. We need a better... We're not... We're obviously going to keep going. Yeah, it's peaking the hut. No necks, ears, or chins. Pitiless to others and each other. Yeah, let's fight. The palace was twice the height of the other huts, and its entrance was wide enough that the three could walk that three could walk abreast. The walls were decorated, and an unknown builder had scratched drawings in the clay while it was still wet. The faded scrawl depicted huge amphibians devouring small figures, some frog headed, others not. Three of the four rooms boasted large holes filled with water, just like the other dwellings, though there were steps descending into them, cut into the dirt. The furthest room we found equipment decorating the walls, other armor, spears, clubs. To our surprise, a number of these items were well preserved. The hut was clearly deserted, so we felt no shame in taking some of them with us. Hey-oh! Uh, buzzing of gnats. Items received short sword. Leather armor. You just picked up a whole bunch of heavy crap? This isn't worth anything. And we move forward. It was ever so lovely to walk once again along the well-trodden path. Our soaked clothes imagined being dry, and our mood at once lifted. The bushes that bordered the path seemed to wave at us amiably, with their juicy green leaves and shiny bright red berries. A fresh wind puffed away the rotten smell, and it finally felt like the swamp might be nearly behind us. But then the wind stopped blowing, and the thorny branches continued to move, and we heard a loud shout. Valerie, who was watching our rear, pointed to a surging, crawling wall of green filling in the path behind us. The surrounding thicket was coming to life. Its branches reached out with a soft, swishing sound. Drops of sap oozed from their thorns, gleaming in the emerald dusk. The path was disappearing. There was no way back. The clear space ahead was closing. Uh, well, we ran further? Let's see. Plus 10 for a DC 16. Or plus 4, that's all you got, buddy? Um... Yeah, ran forward, let's go. Whew, we are getting good with these checks. Check, check. As any experienced traveler can tell you, sometimes you walk and sometimes you run. The branches snatched at our backpacks and clothes, and we, the sprouts tangled at our feet. We slipped their grasp. We were too quick. Finally, after what seemed an endless trek, we came upon the gigantic tree that had so intrigued us from the beginning. Lo and behold, we saw an idol cut into its tru trunk. A huge horned three-eyed toad. Its googly eyes made it look like both cruel made it look <laughs> both cruel and dumb, almost idiotic. Its muzzle hung half open, sharp toothed with several hanging tongues. Deep brown streaks oozed from the corners of its mouth. Lore religion fifteen, we tried to glean what sort of idol it might be. Awful good, that's not us. Um uh, neutral we thought better of interfering with the sinister idol and continued on our journey. Uh, yeah, we should be able to pull that off, no problem. Great. There could be no doubt this was Gaganta. Gagunta, master of the Great Swamp in the Demon Abyss. What is this? 
While we were examining the idol, a large, bright blue dragonfly came out of the hollow in the tree and sat invitingly on the very tip of one of our noses. It was so remarkably strange it didn't react to our movements, and seemed quite content to remain where it sat. Gained 18 experience. Chaotic evil. Fortitude 18. Suddenly Estelle grabbed the dragonfly and held it in front of her, her mouth. Oh gods, did she just decide to eat it. I, mm. Uh, <laughs> uh, the idol reeked of evil. Well, yeah, let's eat the dragonfly. Fortitude 8. What's the check? DC 18. And we will. It's 50 50 shot. Yeah, whatever. Alright. I heard a wet crunch and winced before I could look. And I turned around, hearing a faint cry. Stella turned white and started to collapse. We barely had time to catch her. After returning to life in a few hours, she told us amazing things. Turned out, the Boggard's priests ate blue dragonflies to fall into hypnotic trances, where they could hear the will of the goddess, the demon lord Gagunta, the creature of all Boggard kind. In her dream, Estelle saw ancient times, how the Boggards built their settlements, how they raided the neighbors and enslaved their children, how they held bloody rituals to honor bloated amphibian monsters, the roar of their laughter throughout the dark centuries. She saw a priest bury a stash of plundered jewelry in his hut rather than offering it to his cruel goddess. In return, the wrathful Gagunta set a horrible plague upon his tribe, and that priest would be their last. We turned around to leave the abominable swamp. The flesh-eating bush grew quiet and gave away. On the journey back, we were sure to look inside the priest's hut and dig out the treasure that had once wiped out his entire tribe. Item received, emerald. Gained 54 experience. Close. Cool. All right, well, there's that little adventure. Excavation site? Oh, yeah. We did look at that. All right, cool. Well, we're going to put a cut in here. Um, Come back tomorrow where we wander around aimlessly some more, and hopefully this fog goes away so that we can move the, uh, the main story forward. And... Uh, yeah, that's maybe we'll make it down to the old Sycamore. Uh, I, I do enjoy those uh, storybook encounters. Um, it gives you a real feel of actually role playing while not just uh, throwing dialogue and combat at you. Kind of a neat little system that they put in there. All right, cool. Thank you guys very much for joining me. Um, if you had fun, please hit like. Uh, if you haven't already, please hit subscribe. It makes a big difference. Um, also, if you have not yet, please uh, take a look at my Etsy page. Um, otherwise, you can also catch me on Twitch at uh, I'm Joe Danger Pants. All right, thanks for coming along. Uh, I'm Joe Danger. I appreciate you. Bye forever.